Mankind came into existence, you cannot explain it. The best you can do is that Allah created Adam and Allah gave him the soul. That is all. So, what I'm trying to say is that the issue of Qadr in, the, in Islam is a philosophical issue. The issue of Qadr, that's a limit to which we can understand Qadr. But the most important thing is that your own is to strive, your own is to walk. Don't fold your arms to say, No, that this person has been destined to paradise, this person has been destined to hell, that this person has been destined to be rich, that person has been destined to be poor. You cannot say categorically whether that is the interpretation of Kada. What is important is your own effort. Make effort, struggle, and pray. Prayer can change Kada. Prayer can change destiny. So don't take this issue of Kada, don't take it to too far. Because we can never understand it. Allah has not given us that level of understanding to actually understand exactly what it is. It's like you trying to understand what God looks like. So part of the issue they raised in the, in, the, in, the, in the seminar is the issue of God. I said Allah described himself as Allah nuru samawati wal ar masalu nurihi kamishkoti fiha misbahu al misbahu fi zujadati al zujadatu fa'annahu kawkabun yurriyu yukadu min shadarati mubarakati zaytunati dash I said, now, I said, and I, I challenge them, explain to me how do you describe God? He said it's a light. That is neither this, it's not. I said, tell me, does that show that God is a human being? Does that show what God is located? Does that show what God looks like? I said, it is beyond human understanding. Leave that alone. What you expected, believe in Him, pray to Him, trust unto Him. But what, I'm very sorry. <laughs> but what God looks like is not is, is not within your ability to understand. So leave the issue of Kadar alone. But it, more importantly, Adu'a'u, they said, same for the Mu'umin. Adu'a'u, prayer is the sword of the Mu'umin. You, you, what do you use sword for? To fight to break all your obstacles. So when you pray, you can attain whatever level you want to face. The Quran keeps on emphasizing that call unto Allah. Pray to Allah. But before you pray, believe in Him. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Brother, answer your question. Wa alaikum wa salam wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. There are a few questions that uh, 